Have you ever wondered what would happen if you only watered your plants once a month? Let's test this against various planters to find out. It's been a few weeks since we planted the tomato clones. Let's add a scoop of fast-acting gypsum to prevent end blossom rot and a sprinkle of magnesium to ensure green durable leaves. Mulch was also applied in the form of sphagnum moss. Each specimen was given one final watering to dissolve the nutrients. This will be the last watering they will ever receive. Tomato suckers closest to the ground were hand pruned. A few weeks later, the self-watering specimen died, even though the soil had plenty of moisture. This was most likely caused by root rot, since the water reservoir turned putrid and smelled rotten. But all of the other test groups were growing well. Let's add some trellis to help the plants reach their maximum potential. Tiny roots began to grow down the soil cup. The soil cup works by passively wicking water up, greatly reducing the watering frequency. Over time, roots will grow into the water, which will allow the plant to drink plenty of water. The bucket reservoir looked fairly clean, certainly much cleaner than the self-watering planter's water. However, the cracky specimen appeared to be a bit stunted. Let's check back in about 30 days to see if it will catch up. What do you think will happen? Share your prediction in the comment below.